Good afternoon, folks. Big Bo here with another great fifth wheel toy hauler value from Parkway RV Center. And I'm kind of excited to do this one. I've been uh, waiting on one of these for the last three or four years to come in here so I can shoot a video on it. Um, company I've been following very closely since they were founded. This is a grand design Momentum M Class model number 348M, a 2016 model. Folks, these are pretty much considered the Bluebird Wonder Lodge of fifth wheel toy haulers. This company was founded in 2011. Uh, 2011, Jayco kind of had a, uh, a little bit of a, a mutiny, so to speak, and a lot of the high ranking officials left the company. A lot of the workers did. They went and founded Grand Design, and they took what they learned from working at Jayco, improved it made it where cost wasn't an object. Of course, Jayco cares about keeping their costs down so they, so they can sell their travel trailers at a cheap price, but they instead concentrating on making the best, highest quality, best insulated fifth wheel toy hauler you can buy, and this is a result. Now, this is something the average used uh, toy hauler fifth wheel shopper is probably out of their price range. I'm not gonna lie to you. I know most of you like that 30 to 40 grand price range in a late model fifth wheel toy hauler. Well, this particular one right here, folks, was right at $100,000 new two years ago. And um, you can park this one next to a brand new 2018. You can't tell a nickel's worth of difference in it, except this one's $40,000 less. This one's 59.9. And folks, they don't make many of these new. The, these aren't mass produced like a Keystone or a Forest River or Jayco product is, folks. So that means less of these are sold new because they're kind of the upper end of the price range for a fifth wheel toy hauler. So that means there's less of them on the used market. And not many of these, you're not gonna find many of these for sale. Um, this is an awesome machine right here. And be honest with you, I'm a motorhome man, but this is very tempting to me to, and I don't, I don't even have a toy to, to, to haul, but I would still be tempted to buy this toy hauler. I mean, this is a beautiful RV. I mean, the outside is absolutely spotless. This is a fiberglass cap on the front. This is all laminated aluminum. This isn't fiberglass. This is like what's on a cargo trailer. A lot more durable, a lot more expensive than fiberglass. You got twin power awnings. These are the most insulated fifth wheel I've ever shot. It's got R45 insulation. Heated holding tanks, of course, all enclosed underbelly. Got the six point level up hydraulic leveling jacks. I mean, folks, like I said, I'm not kidding when these, I say these things are $100,000 new. And most of them, you have to special order. Got the aluminum entry steps. Weighs 13,700 pounds, and you've got about a 3,000 pound cargo carrying capacity. Got a 5,500 Onan gasoline generator uh, with 38, almost 39 hours on it. And folks, if it didn't have a Harley Davidson sticker stuck on it, I would think this was a brand new one. I mean, it's that nice. The back porch has got the, uh, the back door has got the back porch kit with the steel cables. It's even got a crank out awning for the back. And it's also got the, um, the rails and everything to go up. So you've got a full back porch back there. Or you can use it as a standard ramp door for a toy hauler. You know, this laminated aluminum, the smooth aluminum, is not going to delaminate like fiberglass. And it's going to hold it shine. The stripes are going to look better on it for longer. Got a lot of advantages. Cost a lot more money to build RVs with this aluminum over the fiberglass. But... Like I said, they took what they learned from Jayco and made and made money, no object, and built the best toy hauler in a fifth wheel that you can buy. And this is the result. Grand design, Middlebury, Indiana. In fact, if next time I'm up that way, I'm probably going to do the factory tour. They offer free factory tours. Three slide outs. Like I say, got the six-point level up system, fuel station. Um, Got a 12-year factory warranty on the roof, so you've still got 10 more years of warranty left on that. And like I said, folks, you can park this next to a brand new 18 model. The only difference you're going to tell is that this one's $40,000 less. 
Now, how somebody in a year and a half got $40,000 worth of use, because they obviously, from the looks of it, only use this thing maybe once or twice. Uh, full storage, got all LED lights, LED tail lights. I've got the uh, LED lights on the front that look really good. It's got them inside as well. It's a beautiful coach, folks. I mean, it's... I guarantee you look at a new Raptor or uh, an XLR or something like that and look at this one. And this is twice the fifth uh, toy hauler those other ones are. The way it's built, the way it's insulated, I mean, the gel coat exterior, the laminated aluminum skin, R45 insulation. And this is considered one of their smaller ones too. Uh, the 348 is 38 and a half feet long. Got LED lights under the aluminum steps. And the inside of this thing, folks, is just absolutely beautiful. Beautiful interior. Let's look inside. And you remember, this is the toy hauler. So, um, and by the way, the exact cargo carrying capacity is 2,994 pounds. Look at this kitchen, folks, or kitchen living room area. I mean, this thing, beautiful. Marble countertops, not Corian, but marble countertops. Stainless steel appliances, including a Norcold 14 cubic foot refrigerator freezer. Island kitchen, fireplace, LED HD TV. Look at these lights in here. Residential style faucets. That's probably a, a $200 faucet right there if you had to replace it. 22 inch tall oven, the bigger oven. Stove top, never been lit. Microwave. Yeah, I like this right here. Looks like an entry door, but it's actually a pantry. I mean, wow. Refrigerator. Of course, I've got it turned up right now, which I'll probably turn that down or to about five. But obviously, it works. And that is one huge refrigerator, and it looks like it's never had anything put in it. <laughs> I mean, wow. I said folks there's not many of these online because they don't build many of them look at this huge sofa now this sofa is a little different this is actually factory got the built-in LEDs underneath it in the cup holders um, these are all also dual pane frameless windows so a lot less maintenance but look here folks all four of these are recliners you've got four recliners right here you sit down, you've got these controls right here, and you got a massaging chair. You turn the heat on, you got a heated massaging chair. Now how cool is that? Of course we got Dr. Phil on the TV. I mean, very thick roof, R45 insulated roof, folks. Your house isn't even that well insulated. I mean, this is a awesome, awesome machine. I'm gonna cut this massaging chair off. <laughs> um, got a fireplace which you can set for the effect or for electric heat. <coughs> got a big furnace. It's got two roof airs. Everything in this thing. Th these are marble countertops. Even ceramic uh, backsplashes. This isn't the cheap vinyl or the plastic one like you see in a lot of RVs. That's ceramic hand laid ceramic backsplash I'm gonna tell you this this right here folks even if you don't need a toy hauler this would be very very tempting to own we'll go here in the garage bay I like the sliding glass door somebody's put the Harley Davidson sticker on it and again folks it doesn't look like they've ever put anything in this garage bay and a lot of people buy these things now that have no desire to haul toys 
you know, on a pretty day, you've got that back porch and you can see the rails on the door. Uh, so you can have some fresh air. You got a screen. Uh, here in the back, you've got two leather uh, bench seats, which you can put a table in between them if you want to. Um, and they make one big bed, one queen bed. Got a queen bed here. So you can sleep four people back here. Uh, push a button. It goes up. Somehow or another. Oh, excuse me. You got a tall roof in here, so this is ideal for side by sides. It's a 12 foot, 12 and a half foot garage bay, eight foot wide, since so this is eight and a half wide body. Uh, it does have washer and dryer hookups in here. Never had one in it. Look at the rubber floor in here, folks. There's no tire marks, no gas and oil stains. They never use this thing to haul toys. I can pretty much promise you that. I got a dovetail for easier loading and unloading. And what that means, see that slant right there at the end of the garage bay before you go to the door? So you've got uh, less of an angle uh, to load up and unload. Of course, we'll put that table all the way up. And I guess I should have put those seats down. But just to give you an idea, this thing's got a lot of space in it, folks. 12 foot. Um, And like I said, even looking at the uh, at the door, this has got the spray-in bed liner material on the door, so you get more traction and, and stain resistant. There's no there's no tire marks on that. Uh, like I said it's got the outside. You've got three awnings on this thing. You've got two power awnings on the side, and the crank awning in the back. I mean, this thing's loaded. Here's your ladders, uh, so you can get to your uh, so you can get to your top queen bed in the loft and then you've got a loft bed on the inside got a place for a tv right there which would only be good i guess if you were in the bed i'm, I'm assuming that's tvs because you've got two of them but got the diamond plate the rubberized floor the diamond plate those are 2500 pound d-rings um, got another entry door back here so this can double not only is a garage bay you can use it if you're not hauling toys. You can use it for a second bedroom that can sleep four people. If um, you know, toy haulers are so versatile, folks. You know, if you've got a, a little league team wanting to spend the night, you can put you can put a slew of air mattresses here, or a, a church youth group. I mean, you can do so many things with this. If you're into flea marketing, great way to use your generator. Live in the front during the weekend at the flea market. Keep your stuff in the back, or if you're into crafts, you can have your own mobile craft shop in here. Or, you know, I sold one of these to a, I've sold toy haulers to a professional barbecue chef that goes around to different barbecue competitions. I've sold toy haulers to uh, professional leather workers who put a mobile leather working shop in the back of one of these. I mean, you can do so much with it. If you need something to live in, or you want to do long term cross country RVing, you got your own 12 by 8 foot garage, your own 12 by 8 foot storage building built into the back of your fifth wheel so you don't have to rent one and keep your stuff with you. Uh, beautiful flooring in here. And like I said, I love that sofa. And that door kind of throws you off, doesn't it? But that is just the pantry. Got a central vacuum system. We're going to walk up here to the front bedroom and bathroom area. Step up here. Got a really nice bathroom. Uh, countertops are nice. Got the medicine cabinet. A very generous sized tub and shower. In fact, that's almost a house sized tub and shower. Got the little seat built in. Got the skylight that looks great. I guarantee you folks, you're not going to find one like this pretty much anywhere else. Got French door leading into the leading into the bedroom. And look at all the crown molding while we're up here. I mean, everything's trimmed out, quarter round on the floor. I mean, it's all right. It's like it's supposed to be, folks. A very cozy front bedroom. And for a toy hauler, pretty roomy. Queen Island bed, premium mattress, LED lights. Of course, I've got the other lights on, so you really can't see the blue lights that well, but it'll look good at night. Overhead storage, those are all hardwood cabinetry. Uh, big closet right here. Got a TV in here as well. Carpet. In fact, I think this, 
Well, there's a little bit of carpet in the slide out, but other than that, this and the slide out under the sofa, that's about all the carpet in here. Easy to keep clean. And, and notice the little things like the curved interior panels to give it a very residential feel. Um, his and her nightstands, plug-ins. It's also got a, a built-in cell phone charging station in the living room. I mean, it's something you just really have to see to believe. And, and yes, I know this is a little higher price range toy hauler than I normally do, but, you know, we, we had a chance to get this one. We've been looking to buy a grand design uh, uh, momentum for years because they're so hard to find. They're considered pretty much top of the line in fifth wheel toy haulers. Of course, they cost a lot more money when they're new than your average fifth wheel toy hauler. And we jumped at the chance to get this one and still selling it for a bargain. Even though $59.9 may sound high to a lot of you, do your research. Look these things up online. This thing's a bargain compared to the few that you do find for sale and certainly a bargain compared to what it cost two years ago. I mean, 40 grand less. That's a lot of money, folks. You can imagine how much you can do with $40,000. And like I said, if this thing's been used, it's only been used once or twice. It's absolutely beautiful in every shape, form, or fashion. Um, oh, it's also six and a half foot uh, ceiling in the, in the front bedroom, too. Just a neat toy hauler anybody be proud to own um 12 foot garage bay and, and the good thing about it is folks uh, as long as your truck's rated for it you know you can still tow this with a with a healthy three-quarter ton diesel pickup truck as long and, and and folks i say that cautiously because every truck is different um before you even think about rv shopping and by fact if you're watching this video um if you haven't already gotten, if you haven't called your vehicle dealer service department, gave them the VIN number and find out what your fifth wheel towing capacity is, not your trailer towing, but your fifth wheel towing, you need to cut the video off, find that out before you even search another RV on the internet. Because a dealer, an RV dealer cannot tell you for certain what your vehicle can tow. Only your vehicle dealer can. So uh, if you ask 10 different RV dealers what your truck can tow, you're going to hear 10 different answers. Uh, that's not something you want to play around with either, folks, because if you get into an accident, you're towing more than what your truck's rated to tow, your insurance company may not pay the claim. So keep that in mind. And you can also pin that bed when it's up so that the only thing you let down are the sofas if you want to, and it'll stay up there. Um, so you can certainly... And these are easy to remove, so if you need extra height clearance, you can take these sofas out. You can take this bed out if you want to, or any combination of the two. Anyway, folks, got the pop-out uh, vents. I mean, and I'm sure I'm missing some stuff going over this RV. So here's what I want you to do. Uh, of course, I want everybody to do their research. I want you to research... 2016 Momentum 348M class. Compare prices, compare condition, options, features, all that stuff. Um, also, if you haven't done it already before you call us, I want you to research the factory brochure. Uh, print it out, study it. You'll know just as much about it or more than I do if you do that. Because, you know, I want people to be educated. I want people to understand what we're selling these things for is still the lowest priced 16 348M on the internet with the equipment, the features, and the options at 59.9. Um, I know it may sound high, but you're used to looking at the at the lower at the at the middle grade ones like the Raptors and XLRs and and Fusions and all that stuff. You're not used to looking at one of this caliber. So it's kind of like looking at a used Toyota and then go looking at a used Rolls Royce. This is a Rolls Royce. Um, it'll cost you more because it costs almost twice as much new as those as, as those other brands. So definitely keep that in mind. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to email us or call us. Our phone number is 706-965-7929. There is that loft bed 
you can use this for storage you can sleep two people up there so actually all in all you can sleep eight people now this sofa does not make a bed it's all four recliners it doesn't make a bed you can sleep one person on it of course so you can sleep two in the front one here two up here four in the back i mean you're going to it'll sleep is is probably it'll sleep more people than you'll want to carry with you let me just put it to you like that and plenty of room for air mattresses if you need to sleep more uh, but give us a call our phone numbers are 706-965-7929 evenings and sundays are for me cut this massaging for my voice starts uh sounding funny um you can call us after hours at 423-605-6747. Call, let us know you're coming. Uh, make an appointment. We'll plug it into power, let you look through it. Um, let me tell you how our pricing policy works, for those of you who don't know. And I know 90% of you subscribe to my channel. You watch my videos. You know how our pricing policy works. But I have to assume everybody watching these videos are watching one for the first time so uh how parkway rv center's pricing works for you know we're 50 year old rv dealership we learned a long time ago to cut out the red tape the bs the 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 trouble the drama the games and the gimmicks out of selling rvs we went to haggle free pricing and the way it works we have two different ways to buy two different prices Option A, option B. Option A is the price that attracted you to this ad to begin with and this video. Uh, it's $59.9. That's haggle-free. It doesn't matter if you're paying cash, if you're financing, if you're trading, or a combination of the three. It's all the same to us. Um, and option A includes the nicest 2016 348M on the market today uh, in a momentum. Also includes a 90-day nationwide limited warranty that can be extended very affordably. And unlike a factory warranty, this can be taken to a Forest River dealer, a Keystone dealer, an independent shop. You don't have to try to find a grand design dealer if you have to have a warranty repair done. So definitely got some pluses there. And you can extend it very, very affordably. And this unit's got a lot of features on it, folks. Way more equipment is on most fifth wheels, so you may want to consider extending the warranty if you can afford it. Um, just to cover those extra features, because those level up systems, that's four or five grand if you ever have to replace them. Um, not only that, but you, this unit, uh, after purchase, is going to go through a very extensive major systems check by our certified RV techs. We go through this massive checklist anything we find wrong with it that's on that checklist we're going to repair or fix it on our dime not going to charge you any extra and when you pick it up or we deliver it everything will be functioning um, and also if you pick it up in person that option a price includes a personal one-on-one -on -one walkthrough with the rv tech that checked it out he's going to spend some time with you show you everything answer any questions you have, show you what all the switches and buttons, how to light your water heater, how to operate your awnings, refrigerator, everything in here, folks. Uh, that's included, plus give you some safety tips, tricks, and things like that. I mean, uh, these guys are good, folks. You're welcome to videotape them, take notes, however you want to do it. That's included, and you also now get a free year of, and this is actually a pretty good value, several hundred dollars it saves you. You get a free year of camping. Um, of course, you want to contact us for all the details and restrictions, but just to give it to you in a nutshell, uh, one year, 21 nights total, uh, up to seven nights at a time at select campgrounds nationwide. Most of them are on the east side of the United States, uh, anywhere from Daytona to New York State. So definitely several very nice campgrounds, and it's completely free. Uh, in other words... You don't pay anything when you go to the campgrounds and use this. All that's covered. So you get that. All that's included for the option A price of fifty nine nine. Now, um, which is a worry-free, stress-free option, you know that you can take it right to the campground. Plus, you get either option you take, option A or B, you get a free starter kit with all your camping essentials, instructional DVDs, and a 30-day nationwide drive-out tag. Um Option B is the only way we discount our prices by uh, offering this RV to you just like it sits. 
the advantage of that is you get to take it home the same day you pay for it instead of waiting a week or two for a, for a checkout. And, um, um, you know, you, you, of course, now you understand option B saves us time and money because we don't have to pay an RV tech to inspect it. We don't have to pay an RV tech to do a walkthrough demonstration. And we don't have to pay, uh, you know, we don't have to pay the warranty company for the warranty. So we will discount this unit because that saves us time and money. So we're going to save you time and money. We'll discount this unit what those services cost us. If you want to price on option B, contact your sales department. You don't have to make a decision based on my video or pictures if you want to take option A or B. Uh, we don't take offers, by the way. There's no sense to send us offers because we're just we're not even going to respond to them. It's option A or option B. Um, uh, what? Um, and if you take option B, of course, you don't have to make that decision based on my video or description. Uh, going back to what I said earlier, of course, anybody coming down should call make an appointment because you need to make sure it's still available first. I never delete my YouTube videos. So, I mean, you know, this is uh, January 31st, 2018. I mean, this could be two or three year old video by the time you watch it, for all I know. I don't delete videos because they help our, our Google search rankings. So you always want to call ahead, make sure it's available, make an appointment, and we'll have the unit plugged into power or we'll crank the generator up, have everything on, let you do your own inspection, spend some time in it, and then decide if you want to do option A or B. It's completely in your control. And I was going to show you that too, by the way. Here's all your controls. There's your charging station, stereo, 38.4 hours, um, gasoline generator, so you got to prime it. Fires right up. Anyway, uh, this unit's 59.9 option A, or contact us for price on option B again. Both prices haggle free. Um, so call us, 706-965-7929, evenings and Sundays, 423 604